Hello and welcome everybody to Simpson Racing here. My name is Simpson and we are back with yet another episode here with American Truck Simulator. And we got a big, uh, a nice little uh, delivery going on over here. Very excited about starting that. And this is actually the first recorded episode of the American Truck Simulator series as I will be traveling on vacation. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode while I'm away. Um, I uh, try to uh, get a lot of them episodes out before I leave, but unfortunately, due to school and uh, and work and oh my goodness, and already I'm already screwing everything up. But uh, but yeah, due to uh, school workload and family functions, I was unable to spend more time on the series and record to you guys as much as I can but uh, you know we're still in it and I hope you guys enjoy the episode and if you get a chance check out my other uh, channel Simpson Roleplay channel as um, I'm actually a member of OCRP with uh, the great Jeff Faviano great guy actually he's like, really awesome but uh, Siv Ryan there Jeff Faviano's there a great community and uh you know once applications open up make sure you guys go check it out it's pretty awesome and uh definitely a lot of fun playing uh role you know role playing community so anyway enough of that i hope you're all doing great uh it's actually saturday morning i'm recording this uh <laughs> four o'clock in the morning for you guys before i leave on vacation so Really hope you guys enjoy this, and yeah, let's see what we're going to be doing today. So today, actually, there's not really a set schedule for us in this episode. Um, I want to explore as much as we can and get some money. We actually have about $84,000 in the bank right now. Which is fantastic. It's really great. And um, I was thinking about like paying off a loan, but I was like, well, you know, I want to have the flexibility and the extra money that we got. So I don't want to worry too much about running low on cash. So I figured, why not just leave the money in the bank? We can make the payments. You know, it's a uh, nine thousand dollars a day, so might as well just leave it there. It's really not going to do anything if we just pay off one loan. We still, we're, you know, shaving off what a, an extra thousand uh, dollars from the daily payments. So I was like, you know what, just leave it. Nothing's going to happen. Just leave it. You know, make the daily payments, and we'll be good to go. So. That's what I'm going to do during this episode. I'm not really going to bother paying off a loan. I'll keep the money. And also in case, you know, something comes up that's new for the truck, I can go ahead and, you know, and get it without worrying about not making the payments or anything. So with that being said, we are actually heading off to, I kind of forgot where we're going. We're going to Yuma, which I believe might be... I'm going to say still Arizona, but I'm not quite sure. So I'll wait until we get there and then we'll find out. It's not really that far in game wise. Uh, we have about 250 miles to go. So it's a pretty, it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good looking, you know, job. It's about like $15,000, I believe, uh, is how much they're going to pay us upon delivery. So, you know, looking forward to it. Let's see what happens. But other than that, you know, I, I you know I haven't really been able to get a lot of episodes out for you guys, so hopefully this will hold you over until I get back. Uh, I did, however, upload a lot of uh, older episodes that I had from my previous uh, roleplay community in uh, Midwest RP. So make sure you guys check it out as well. It will be in the other channel, Simpson Roleplay channel. Feel free to check it out, and if you like the videos, you know, give it a like if you want. Um, you know, I do this stuff for you guys, really, so you guys can enjoy it and have fun as much as I do. 
But with that being said, I did download a few mods. I remember I spoke earlier in previous episodes about how I didn't like the way the game looked, especially on my OBS. I mean, I, again, I don't know if that was just me or that was the same thing for you guys, but I did look at the videos on YouTube and I didn't really notice a drop in the colors on the screen. So I'm guessing it's working fine. You know, if that makes any sense. Um, I did try to find uh, a graphics mod. I downloaded it and then I believe it's still there. I honestly don't remember if it's still installed in the game or not, but I will check after the recording is over and you know, so far it seems to be doing a pretty good job. I mean, you know, it's not that bad. You know, I, the graphics look a lot brighter on my end. Uh, the game looks at a little brighter as well, so you know, it's looking, uh, it's not too shabby. Right now it's 5.40 in the morning game time, Thursday, and we're supposed to get this thing delivered uh, at 9 a.m. game time, so we should be doing a pretty good job getting this over uh, in a timely fashion. We have almost a full tank of gas, so that's not an issue as well. Oh, let me see if I can get the microphone a little bit. There we go, a little bit closer here, so that way you guys can hear me a little better. But yeah, so, you know, everything looks pretty good so far. No complaints. And the game drives just as good if not better and honestly I really want to I keep forgetting to do this but I wanted to go into the settings and increase the force feedback on my wheel because I still feel it's a little light and I want to have and I want to have that little heavy uh, you know sensation especially when I'm steering you know uh, or, or uh, you know I can feel the road just fine so that's not really uh, a big one for me but I wanted to increase the force feedback just a little bit so we can get that more of a realism, you know, thing going on. There we go. I always like to, you know, honk the horn every time I see another truck coming in the opposite direction. It's like a nice gesture. I mean, I think it, I, I think it is. I mean, I'm not sure if it's, if they do that in real life, but Man, driving on Turkos MP is a completely different experience from driving in a single player mode. Only because, you know, there are, I think the biggest thing is that there are no other trucks. You know, so. With that being said, no. It, it makes it a little bit easier to drive because you don't have to worry. You don't really notice a lot of cars, and you have to you have to get stuck in traffic. There we go. I believe there's somebody behind me. Yeah, there's somebody behind me in a civilian vehicle. Yeah, he is behind me. There we go. I think he's uh, he works for a trucking company. And he's probably going to meet up with them, so that's pretty cool. So I'm not really sure why he's pulling over. But we're not going to worry too much about that. Now, there are, uh, you know, other... Again, Truckers MP is like having a 5M server made for American Truck Simulator and Euro Truck Simulator. And there are other communities, per se, if you want to call it that, um, where they jump on and they do jobs together and so on and so forth. So, 
that is seriously cool and they have different positions and truckers and all that stuff so it's uh it's really awesome that they have this sort of thing i haven't really joined any company per se but uh i would be very open to joining one or even creating my own company i mean i think on truckers mp you can create your own company um and then you know you it pretty much logs how often you drive the, the length of your trips that you take you know especially traveling between states so on and so forth so it's really really cool to be able to see that happening here but either way you know that dude is back on the left hand side here i can see my, my rear view mirror and uh yeah, I, I don't know if he's trying to do something. I don't know what he's doing behind me, but hey, I'm not going to complain for a free escort. The game starts to brighten up a little bit as we approach 6.10 a.m. game time. Let's go ahead and switch out our camera. there we go and that's how you do it this is how you do it because I knew this what happened there I wish I could answer you buddy can you hear me can you hear me can you hear me no I think it's this one can you hear me hello yes I can oh okay yeah, uh, yeah. I don't know what happened. I think I saw a rabbit jump in front of me, and then uh, next thing you know, I hit the uh, hit in the divider. Yeah, I was just watching, and I'm like, oh, whoa. Yeah, yeah. No, it's uh, it's something. I think I'll try to go into the uh, into the rest area. Let's go ahead. If you guys noticed from my previous episodes, I did talk about how every time I switch cameras and the road turns, I end up hurting myself. And it just happened right in front of my eyes. Man, this is gonna be something. It's All right. Well, are you just gonna have to teleport somewhere? Are you gonna like just try to get it somewhere? Yeah, I have about a, like a hundred miles to go, so I'll be able to make it. But thank you for checking up, man. I appreciate it. Do you need me to follow you? Uh, it's really up to you. I'm going to try to, I guess, punch it out and see what happens. I'll probably follow you so you don't lose your load and lose a lot of money off of the big tractor there. Yeah, I'd appreciate that. Thank you. Sure. Come on. On, baby we can make it we have a hundred miles to go we should be fine
But I did, I did talk about it. I did mention it before, and it happened again. Unbelievable. That is too funny. I think I lost my uh, third uh, third set of gears there. almost there we got 85 miles to go we're gonna grind this baby out and get it there as fast as we can doing 45 miles per hour all right so we got 14th gear now Let's see if we can shift into 16th. Or 17th, actually. Was there 65 miles more to go? That is just too, it's just too funny how I talked about it and I said it. And I said that every time, if, if you, if, I promise you, if you look at my other videos, you will hear me talk about how I said. That if I change my camera angle, and if I'm not paying attention, I end up smashing my car, truck. And that's exactly what just happened right then and there in this episode. Unbelievable. But it's okay. It's okay. We got it. We are 50 miles out. Almost there. I'm actually very proud of this truck. I mean, you know, it's a lot of damage. But hopefully there's no damage. Well, there's 11% damage to the trailer, which unfortunately will deduct from my payment. But my truck is 58% damaged. So that's going to be interesting to see how much they're going to charge me now. Five miles to go and we're almost there
Yuma discovered. So I'm guessing after this, we're going to go ahead and fix our truck. Come on, baby. Four miles out, man. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it, baby. right there. Come on now, baby. Come on. And let's come back here. Let's go ahead and you put it right there. Come on, turn it back on. Go.
doesn't want to line up. This is as close as it's going to get because I took a really bad angle. Look right there. I hate that thing in the middle. I hate it. Not gonna happen. Not happening. It's just not gonna happen. Why are you doing this to me? That's it. Is it dead? I should have just left it there. This is getting ridiculous now. It's the stupid angle. I'm determined now. I'm gonna get it. Come on. Uh, this is so frustrating.
got to do it again. Try coming like out of the parking lot and then coming back in that might work. If you can't get it this time. I'm like literally in it. Really? Really? Yeah, it's not happening. I'm going to have to get out of the parking lot and come back in. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, come out of the parking lot, recenter yourself, and then I can block the... baby come on Does that road go completely around? Because if that doesn't work, then we'll have to come through the other side. Yeah, we'll see what happens, man. Yep. There we go. Oh, you son of a gun. Oh, man, I think that worked. Yay. Oh, man, what a job trying to park this thing. Definitely looks like it. All the lights are off on the trailer. Oh, man. Satisfactory. Yeah, whatever. You can just kiss it. All right. Yeah, man. Awesome job. Thank you for blocking the street off. I appreciate it. Can you come out to the road and tell me I can't hear you with all this loud background noise? Come on. Come on. Come on. All right. I'll be right there. Okay. 
Oh, come on, damn it. Yeah, so, um, yeah, it worked. I mean, it was uh, pretty good, and thank you for blocking off that street for me. Yeah, you sure. All right, man, thanks for following me, and uh, hopefully I'll see you around. See you around. Bye. All right, that was seriously cool. All right, I mean, it's the longest parking job of my life. Oh, my goodness, but we really got to work in, uh, and really need to head off and uh, and fix it. So I'm guessing this is still in Arizona. So anyway, let's go over here and see if we can get this truck fixed. Otherwise, we're going to be in for a long day. All right. Come on, baby girl. Oh yeah, there's no uh You boys wanna watch a trick on that uh, railroad because all those yards are like that. Yeah, thanks. Let's go ahead and fix this truck up. Eight grand. So I pretty much made four thousand dollars out of that last trip, which is fantabulous. Now let's see if we got any upgrades coming here. All right, anything going on? Nope. Uh, level twenty. We're not quite there yet, so uh, we still got a little bit to go. Engine is the same. Transmission is the same. Interior. Are you gonna do any more big loads, or do you, or are you just gonna like get off? Uh, let's see here. All right, there's nothing much going on, so let's just do one more, I guess, and he can follow me, and then that's it. Uh, oh uh, yeah, I'm actually recording right now, but uh, yeah, let's do one more uh, load. Okay, yeah, I can follow if you want me to. Sure. All right, let's see. Uh, let me take a look at the map real quick, and then we'll go from there. Okay. All right, fellas, let's take a look at the map here and see what we can do. Since we're already in Yuma, let's uh, let's see if we can maybe like go to. Well, let's see what we got. That's a long one, actually. Holy smokes! I don't want to go back east. I want to stay west. All right. What do we got here? What was there was one over here? Yep. What is that? This is Las Vegas. All right, let's do that one. All right, we're gonna go pick up a, a trailer and head off to Las Vegas.
Holy smokes. Oh, man. I knew you sound familiar. I subscribed to you on YouTube. No way, are you serious? Yeah, I've been subscribed for a little while and then I was like, wait a second, he sounds f Oh, I think when I started moving. that thing. Oh, it's right there. I might see where this caravan's going because I'm it might be going to the same place Where does where is yours going? Mine is going to uh, Las Vegas Okay, I'll be right back Oh man, that is so funny All right, Hold on, I just, I just want to see something here because it's it seems like the keys Hmm so for this one, let's do the primary, maybe that. There we go. So that when I talk to him, it doesn't, you know. But for the gameplay, I want to increase. It's going to Holbrook. All righty then. Hold on one second, bud. There we go. Increase the game. All right, uh, it's up to you. Nah, I'll just leave it here. All right, so wait, do you even know who I am or you just think you subscribe to me? I'm sorry, what? No, I'm saying, do you, do you think, do you think you know who I am? I don't know you, but I know your YouTube channel. Like, I've been subscribed for a while, and I knew, like, you sounded familiar. And I was like, wait a second. So I went back and looked at my YouTube, and I was like, oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> that's pretty awesome, man. Well, you know what? If you want, you can park your car next to my truck, and I'll make that my thumbnail. Okay, do you want lights on? or? Uh, let's put the lights on. I'm sorry, do you got a copy in us? Ah, that is gorgeous. Let's uh, get the saturation up here a little bit. Not too much, though. There we go. Let's get something going on here. Some, some. There we go. Oh yeah, little little action right there. Oh yes, give me some more of that. Oh my gosh, fantastic! All right, man, excellent. I got a whole bunch of them. It's gonna look sick. Cool. All right, let's get the heck out of here. You want us to hook up a load and run with you, boys? Alrighty then. Alright, let's go ahead and 
turn this baby around. goodness we're at uh, Las Vegas is yours going Gonna be going to charged. It's gonna be going to charged in Las Vegas. That is too funny. Oh man, that's awesome. I keep like forgetting, not forgetting, but like I keep putting it into the wrong gear. Go. Is he not? Uh, I think he's still in Yuma. Where is he? I think it's kind of behind me, though. I guess he uh, either got disconnected or wasn't able to follow through. It's all good. It's pretty awesome, Domi. Like, what are the odds of some you play with somebody who subscribed to your channel? It's pretty fantastic. Well, thank you so much for subscribing, man. I do appreciate it whenever you get a chance to rewatch this video. Um, That's it, it, pretty fantastic, actually. That's awesome. Love it. Love it. Oh, my God. Look at this view, man. Oh my goodness. That is just wonderful. Ugh. Fix up my seat a little bit. Get a little bit closer here. There we go. What a view this is. Kill off our lights. Oh man. This is just wonderful. Look at that. That's amazing.
That is just amazing. But here we are. All righty then. So yeah, I mean, you know, this is pretty cool. And you know, even though the last job I ended up netting about four grand, you know, it is what it is. But we did get the experience, so the experience was a plus. Um, that's what it's all about, really, at this point. But man, was that a lot of fun! That was just amazing. What are the odds? It's going to be a killer thumbnail, I'll tell you that. I'm going to work on it and make sure it looks fantabulous and get the baby up and running. It's going to look great. We're still not even a half a tank of gas. Like, that's pretty awesome. You know, we are not even three quarters. Oh, wow. That looks great. Look at that. Oh, oh yeah. Like, we're not, we're not even approaching. We're barely approaching the half a tank mark. So, this is pretty good for, for you know, two big jobs. We did the first was about 300 and some miles. The second job was about 400 miles, so that's 700 miles, and we're not even at the half tank. That's amazing. It's great. I think we'd probably like cap that at 65 miles per hour. It will only go faster if you're going downhill, which is fine. And we're already approaching the 300 mile mark. That was pretty quick. No, I mean, this is what it's all about, really. Just, you know, just to drive. And it's a really relaxing game. You know, I can't really stress that enough of how relaxing this game is and get to sit there and just enjoy the game amazing 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 <clears throat> gonna be making a left here coming up I believe, I, I believe, I mean, the game does look a little bit better, but I think I might still have the pack installed in the game. So.
It's so funny when I actually kind of turn my head a little bit to the left to see the oncoming traffic. Hilarious. Hilarious. This is great. Pick it up some speed. We're approaching the 250 mile mark. Boy, oh boy, is this a lot of fun. This is a lot of fun. Now we're going up north towards Las Vegas. I mean, I, you know, I gotta say, this is, this is pretty dope. You know, the way, I don't know what it is, but the way the roads are constructed and built in the west it is so much better than they are in the east hands down i mean i've been to california i've been to texas a bunch of times actually and let me tell you the roads constructed is just a work of art you know I remember I drove from Texas, I drove in Texas maybe a thousand miles in, in all of my trips. And if I tell you the amount of bridges on top of bridges that I've seen in Texas, in Houston actually, amazing, amazing. Never thought for one second I would see uh, you know bridges built on top of highway built on top of a highway it's insane we don't have that back here in Jersey so what we have in Jersey is a bunch of cobwebs just put together it's not even good looking can do it all right so I did increase the force feedback a little bit and I am feeling it in my turning more than anything I'm not feeling more vibration but I'm feeling it in my turning it's not as light it's more it's a little bit of a pullback it's like you're fighting against the steering wheel which is fine I love it no complaints whatsoever All right, we are approaching the 200 mile mark. And we're actually going pretty fast. I mean, you know, it's pretty good. It's 11 o'clock in the morning game time and we're supposed to deliver this thing by three o'clock in the afternoon game time or Pacific time. So we are doing pretty good. And now it's actually, it's like, it's like we're beating the GPS. You know, it's like 252 right now. We're doing a pretty good job, 251. So this is spectacular. If we can, if we can reach the hundred thousand dollar range, I'll be very, very happy with that. I mean, just look at the scenery around you. It's just fantastic. You know what they should start doing on this server is still like you know people if they want to be like cops or something you know they can have people show up you know
a Ford Crown Vic or, you know, a Dodge or something. And then pull truckers over. That would be hilarious. the mountains and the amount of detail in this game is unbelievable. I love it. Like, just nothing but open fields. There's nothing. Just desert. How amazing is that? I know I'm like I'm like drooling over this, but honestly, traffic in the west I, I believe is better than traffic in the east. It's just because everything is so, you know, compact and just thrown together. But in the west it's larger first of all, you get larger states, alright? And they're spaced out, so there's no interstate travel or interstate travel. Come on, baby girl. Just past the 150 mile mark left to go. We're doing a heck of a job. First it was 3 o'clock. Now we're supposed to be there at 149. But we're doing pretty good on we're doing really good on time. We're fine. I love when to beat the GPS in the game. Don't get your minds twisted, fellas. And ladies. Would it suck to be stranded on a highway like this in the middle of nowhere? Oh man, can't even imagine. Can't even imagine. All right, we're approaching the 100 mile mark left to Las Vegas. I mean, I can also decrease the sensitivity when we get there, because I can't do it while I'm driving on the server. But I can definitely decrease the sensitivity just a little bit, so that way it's not picking up 
every little movement I'm making, so. But overall, we're doing a pretty darn good job with this. This is just fantastic. Hong Kong. There we go. They almost always respond. Almost always respond. We got about 65 miles left to go. And we are doing fantastic. Let me know in the comments below, you guys, when you watch this video. Should I do the tablet? input on the screen so you guys remember in my previous videos I would have I would have the tablet showing up on the bottom left corner of the screen would you like to see the tablet or do you not care about it I mean I don't have to put it on but you know if you want to see the tablet just let me know in the comments um, and I'll keep it there if not I'll just take it out but just let me know to me it doesn't matter I mean I, I can put it and not put it it's not a big deal but I feel like I want you guys to get more of the view of, of the, the tablet in the game. But if it, I'm, well, I mean, like, I want you guys, sorry, I wanted you guys to get more of the game. Uh, and I feel like the tablet was taken away from that because it was, it would take up some, you know, space on the screen and it takes away from the game. So if it doesn't matter and just leave it on, I'll leave it on. If not, I'll just, you know, I'll take it off. But to me, I don't care. You know, I can deal with it or without it on the screen. But it's really up to you guys what you would like to see. Wow, so we have 35 miles left to go. And we are just passing the half a tank mark. How crazy is that? That's crazy. Twenty-five miles to go, and we should be right there. Oh, got a little palm tree action going on over there. Look at that. Welcome to Las Vegas.
All right, let's see what we got here. Okay. Uh, I mean, we can do it. Yeah, let's just do it. You can do it. I think I parked here before. Why do I always take my turns so tight? see the trailer there I do now all right come on buddy wow barely made it I couldn't really tell which one was the parking spot. All right, buddy. Either I overshoot it to the right or to the left. We're gonna get it, don't worry. There we go. Would you look at that. I guess all I needed was some space. <laughs> you guys are awesome, seriously. Look at that. That is fantastic job. Let's go ahead and unload the trailer and see how much money we got from this job right here. Excellent work. 35 minutes to do this job. 65 gallons. And uh, we have finished 25 World of Trucks contracts completed. We made $16,000, so it's not too bad. I mean, we're almost, almost at the, oh, we just passed $103,000. That is fantastic news. I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. The question is, can we buy another garage? Let's see here. So let's see. I don't know if we can buy another one at this moment. Uh, I think we would have to do that in the single player mode. But with that being said, you guys are fantastic. I love you guys so much. And I think it was pretty phenomenal that I was able to play with someone who actually subscribed to my channel. I think that's what are the odds? Hey, man, thank you so much for 
escorting me, making sure I lose my truck, blocking off the street, and, you know, it's unfortunate that you couldn't follow me to Las Vegas, but thank you so much for your continued support. I really, really sincerely appreciate it, and you guys are awesome. Um, I really enjoyed this episode. I wish I could have recorded more for you guys before I go on vacation, but, you know, this will do for now until I get back uh, next week, hopefully next week. But anyway, uh, I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you liked it, give it a like if you want, if you feel like it. If you don't feel like it, make sure to give it a thumbs down. Uh, if you haven't done so already, feel free to subscribe so you can at least watch uh, my other channels and just keep track of what I'm posting. But uh, yeah, you guys are amazing. Have a wonderful day, evening, whatever it is that you're doing. Uh, be safe. Enjoy your time. Enjoy yourself. And I'll be seeing you in the next episode. Take care. Simpsons out. Peace.